Yo, what is up everybody? Welcome back to another video. I know it's been about a month since I've last posted. Um, I hope everybody's Christmas break and New Year's was great. I think this is my first video of the year, so Happy New Year now in February. But um, today I just want to go through a video of how I managed to score 34 plus on the ACT with um, as minimal studying as possible. For those of you wondering how my early action and college decisions went, I'm not going to spoil anything. Uh, Y'all are going to have to wait until the college decision video coming out in March, which will be, or April. That'll be really exciting to see. So uh, in about two months, it'll be out once we get all the rest of our decisions back. But until then, we'll just be chilling. But yeah, for this video, I'm going to be going over how to score as high as possible in the ACT um, with as little studying as possible. Alright y'all, so I'm about to put you guys on some crazy game right here. The one word you need to know for how to score high or like learn as fast as possible is walkthroughs. So I think this is honestly a really underrated way of studying for the ACT. So on YouTube, there are like hundreds of videos, I think, of just walkthroughs of people going through practice tests and solving each problem, especially for math. I think Scalar Learning has a few, and if not, he at least has the... um. The concepts like every single math concept on the act i know that his walkthroughs might have been deleted by act because they did not want those up on the on the youtube channel for some reason i'm not really too sure um how that happened but that was quite unfortunate but he still does have a lot of like concept reviews and he goes through basically every single concept that can show up on the test itself and then there's also a bunch of other youtubers a bunch of other like smaller channels who um do walkthroughs for math especially like here let me let me find a few yeah so like right off the back prep pros has a good one i watched that one actually um their act math test expert tips from a perfect score that's um that's the thumbnail of that one and then five academy also has a few good walkthroughs um i definitely do like their channel as well whenever i was reviewing for my act um so for math i think honestly like 10 to 15 hours of studying of just going through all the materials and watching a few walkthroughs is kind of all you need in order to learn the material and then from there it's just practice tests just practicing with official act practice tests if you can and then um just reviewing what you got wrong and then another really good channel that i recommend is ivy tutoring this dude has a ton of reading walkthroughs english walkthroughs and math walkthroughs i think he even has a few science ones it is absolutely insane this is probably the the one thing that i did to increase my reading score besides actually taking practice tests I literally just watched his videos because um, he does tutoring sessions with clients, I believe. And then he uploads the video of him basically walking it through with uh, with his clients. And it's absolutely amazing. And he's really smart at doing it. Um, same with the ACT English, uh, reading, science, math. There's He basically has everything on there. So that is honestly an underrated channel that is super good for studying. So now I also want to quickly highlight the importance of taking official practice ACT tests because these are the most realistic to what you'll be taking whenever you're taking your test. Um, there's a few on the internet. I think there's a few on the official ACT website. Um, but if you can't get uh, or if you've already taken all the official practice ACTs out there, I guess you can do Princeton reviews and all those others. Um, I guess, I mean, they're all right, but I think the official practice ACTs are the most realistic and the best way to prepare. And then, um, so a quick little tip for math. So timing is really what gets people on math. I know that some of the concepts are difficult, but once you've studied those, you have to really work on your timing. So basically I like the 10, 20, 30 rule. So what that means is 10 minutes for the first 20 sections, 20 questions, 20 minutes for 20 through 40, and then 30 minutes for 40 through 60 because 40 through 60 are the hardest questions and you're going to basically need the most time in order to solve them and then something quick for you guys is mental you need to have the confidence that you can do it i know each of you guys definitely can especially if you're willing to put in the time to work um practice is one way to develop that confidence as you do more practice you're going to become more confident in your abilities so that when you do take the actual act you can do it and then of course if you get stuck on a question during the actual act don't waste all your time on it. The ACT is like the one test where you cannot be wasting time. So if something really just stumps you, honestly, just take a good guess and move on. So yeah, with a combination of walkthroughs and reviewing your official practice test, I think that anybody can get the score they wanted. I definitely was able to get the score that I wanted. If you guys didn't know, I got a 34 with a 35 in English, 35 in math, 35 in science, and a 31 in reading. I took the test twice. The, the first time was like my blind test just to see what I could get without studying at all. And then I put about 20 to 30 hours in 
of walkthroughs and about 10 hours of practice tests and i was able to increase my score to that 34. yeah though thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you guys did enjoy it i'm gonna try to upload more honestly i just felt like sitting down on this night this sunday night i have school tomorrow I'm about to go to bed but i just felt like sitting down and talking a little bit about the act and i guess some tips for it um if you guys have any other videos you want to see or anything else you just you guys just want me to talk about that's kind of what i do on the channel i just sit down and just talk about various subjects just let me know in the comments down below um i hope you guys have a great night great day great morning and i will see you guys back here in the next video peace out